Hi everyone, Cinder here. Welcome back to more Dragon Quest XI. With a new enemy. I thought it was going to be some kind of ghost, but... Sham Hat Witch. <laughs> it should have been Ham Hat Witch. Sham because it's not actually a hat witch. I like that it's a tiny boar with a spooky looking hat. You may be my favorite enemy I have seen so far. And I really like the Great Saber Cub. <laughs> it's a tiny boar. <laughs> oh, that's great. Some of these enemies are just too cute. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh, that's great. Feel bad for the sham hat witch. <laughs> Defended, hide in the hat. <laughs> oh, that's too good. Oh, it is enemy. I hope there's some kind of like where you can easy get pets or something. I don't even have to use it in battle like DQ8. I, all, all I need is just like to have pets because I think that would be really cool. Probably not, but yeah. I shouldn't have even said that because now there'll be comments. Oh, just wait and see. Now I'm gonna have to record like 50 episodes ahead. Oh well, too late now. I know there's the power of editing, but that's. You're different. Or maybe it's just because it's not, it's a uh, daytime. Leafy Lampling. No, you're different. Or because daytime. Probably should hit the Lampling. Ew. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. These enemies are not mind taking. <laughs> that thing's a cool design. Oh, not enough. Good to hear that sound. I blame you for this, T23. Huh. 24x. How close are we to level? What are we looking at here? 108, 208. Career criminal is Eric. I didn't see what he was before. Darn. Gotta remember to do that one. And it's still future than that. To see if it changes over time. Shoulder charge into that. Alright, nothing new. But still worth grabbing because obviously we can use these. Small scale there. Creepy mushrooms. Fungal. Yeah, you 
see the scale shield, which is great. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. You're something new. You're the small scale. I need the small scale. The pine we haven't used yet, and we've gathered a few of those. We just run around and grab all of it. Here's the scale. Up. Up again. Copper ore, copper ore, flintstone. Awesome. Take this. Might as well. Might as well grab. almost missed that. A single vial? Yes. Gratefully pocket that. Having 10 more MP is not a bad thing. And being able to get 10 MP back. state at will. Oh, I want that skill. <laughs> Party place. Oh! Where we... He was like, oh, don't come this way. Which means we're right by Cobblestone. Yep. Ooh, this is not gonna be good, is it? It didn't sound good from the way they talked in the castle. will be burning. I'm glad to see it's not. You all need to leave. Born here? <laughs> yeah, sure you were. And I'm the king of Heliodor. <laughs> uh, okay, now that's, that's even more creepy. Yes, I was born here. Spirit of Land is watching over you. Gather your courage and do what you have to do. You're meant to be together. A little busy at the moment. By the thing, looks of things, I will be for a little while yet. What happened here? There is nowhere to be seen.
Hi. Where to see Travelers in Cobblestone? Hope you enjoy your stay. Though we don't have an inn or anything, I'm afraid. Do have his Amber. She's always very hospitable, and I'm sure she'll be happy to put you up if you ask nicely. Lives on the east side of the village. Did you just... Did you wipe their minds somehow? Wipe their memories? Oh, these people... Not in the right mind, hypnotized. Cheeky so and so, you'd never believe his latest trick. He hit a frog in a jug of water, and when I took the lid off, it jumped out of me. He almost died of shock. Now water's soaking wet. When I catch that cinder, I'll have his guts for garters. What? Yeah, that's me. Don't be silly. There's no use covering for him, you know? And I can't access the item shop. Yeah, this is bad. Okay. Enough of that. I smell a stew wefting from Amber's window. Kill for a bowl for it. Try it. Nothing like a little home cooked dinner every now and then. Cooking your favorite stew. It'll be ready any minute now. You'll be desperate to stuff your face as always, I'm sure. Well, set the table and I'll just give it a last little stir. Whoa! Who are you? And what are you doing in my house? Yeah. What nonsense are you talking? My boy is six years old. Who do you think you are, waltzing in here and claiming to be someone you're not? Whoever you are, I want you out of my house this instant. Don't make me say it twice. This place gets set back ten years somehow? <laughs> ah, I fell off right at the end. <laughs> ah, <aw. laughs> All right. Grab whatever this is. that tree over there. I also see the Yggdrasil. There's some Yggdrasils here. I'll never get it back. Ghost headscarf is stuck in the tree. Yes, retrieve it for her. Here you go. Huh? Thank you, mister. Gemma, who are you? Uh, that can't be right. Oh, wait, I get it. That's not your name. You mean you're looking for him, right? He went to look for Chalky. Come on, follow me. <laughs> what happened here? Cure's power emanates from the root wrapped around the tree. Yeah, please help fix this. Where'd she go? 
Hello, Gemma. Yeah, but I don't see you. Oh, and the, the puppy <laughs> it's, it's just a puppy. <laughs> Ten years ago, you know, it's all small. scarf off and now it's stuck up a tree. <laughs> well, we can't be having that now, can we? Let me go and find it for you. Hmm? We don't need the ladder anymore. That nice man over there got my headscarf down for me. He said he was looking for you. Is he a friend of yours? Nope. I've never even seen him before. I think it might be me he's looking for, you know. Why don't you two run along and play and leave us grown-ups to talk? Huh? All right. <laughs> <laughs> Since you were a baby, after all, I knew it was you right away. But you don't look too happy, my lad. Care to tell you, old Grandad, what's on your mind? Grandad, what's going on? Everything that's happened. I see. So, you're from a future where I'm no longer around. Yeah. Well, well. <laughs> From everything, from everything we've learned here, yes. And King Carnelian went and threw you in the dungeon. Yep. And to think I trusted that he'd do right by you. Okay, Grand. If I'd known how things were going to turn out, I would have told you everything. Instead of hiding the truth from you for all those years. But you don't have time to be listening to an old man's regrets. Here's what we're going to do. If you head east out of the village, you'll come to Cobblestone Falls, as you know. Go there and dig in front of the three-sided rock. Dig in front of the three-sided rock. that? Hmm? The three-sided rock at Cobblestone Falls. You'll know the one I mean. But what a fine figure of a man you've become. I'm so glad I got to see you all grown up. See the glitch there? You'll be good now, lad. Yeah. Don't waste your time bearing grudges. Live life with love in your heart. Always saw me right. Bye now. Thanks, Granddad. Okay, there's, there's a, more information there. Uh, cobblestone Falls. Me with Jim in the center of Cobblestone, apparently what we're, what we're doing here. And we're going to the falls.
chance of getting Gemma's headscarf back for her. Come back and play any time you like. <laughs> Mark was going there. Yeah. Are you okay? I lost you for a minute there. Not surprising, I guess. Oh, that was... Okay, so all that was Igdrasil trying to help me. Cool. That's what I expected. Darn it. <laughs> Although, more flames, but... Yeah, this is bad. That, that's really bad. I can't believe they do this. Yep. And just because you grew up here? What kind of animals are they? They're terrible. Jasper and his goons must have ridden straight here after you got thrown in the dungeons and torched the place. Yeah, they did. So it, was, it took us back and Inderso was giving us information there. Hey, just now when you zoned out, the mark on your hand was glowing. And so was the root wrapped around that tree. Was it another one of those visions? Yes. That's really cool. That's neat. So a cobblestone wow. in the past. So you you went back in time and spoke with your granddad and and yourself? Yep. That is seriously weird. Yeah, that's that's weird. Must have Yay been power of the world tree. It must have the power to show you the past. Well, if what your granddad told you was right, then we need to head over to Cobblestone Falls. Yeah, for sure. Where did you say it was? East of the village? Yeah. Listen, I know this can't be easy, but hanging around here isn't going to do anybody any good. Come on. Yeah. You're right. Traveling priest. I heard a terrible rumor that this village was to be razed to the ground and rushed from Heliodor to try to reason with the troops. Alas, it seems I was too late. King Cornelia ordered the entire place to be destroyed for its role in raising the accursed Darkspawn. But do the people of Coverstone really deserve this? No. Seeing such terrible devastation, one wonders who the real sinners are. At least the troops did not destroy the church. That is something. Inside you'll find a bed where a traveler may yet rest his weary bones. Now that those things may look bleak, one may still find comfort in the age-old rituals. Interesting because I thought maybe it was some kind of spell cast here. Not by Idris, but by by bad guys. So that was a that was a really neat neat twist there. All the way around. I like that. Spirit. Recipe book entitled Oh Holy Night. Templar's uniforms? Okay. That's not too bad. Just a little low on it. An antidote. Probably put in the item bag.
Rich of the mayor, ferocious monsters are outside large are large outside the village. No, that didn't change. Gemma's house. Medicinal herb. It's terrible. Cypress stick. Nighttime. I guess I will sleep in the in the church then. Just destroyed the entire place. There's the item shop. I think that was the item shop. One of the shops. Maybe a note or something here, but nothing. A small village, but yeah, you know, they didn't have any any chance. East of the village, so maybe that Emerald Coast. Yeah, head to the Emerald Coast. Okay. That is our next destination. And we will head there next time. Thank you very much for watching. And until the next episode where we'll see what um what our granddad and Ibrisil want us to to find I'm Cinderay 9 remember to shoot for the stars and take care of